if you have sent forty thousand dollars and I've, I've not gotten it maybe it's on it's in the pipeline as the politicians say but the two people who recorded the video and said that I've taken forty thousand dollars and Captain Spart has taken fifty thousand I don't know about anybody else I'm talking about me me I said I eat based on my integrity and today being my birthday if anybody has given me forty thousand dollars when I cross the street may a car knock me let me die or if I'm in my car, let, the, let somebody knock me and let me die. If I'm not taking $40,000 in the name of God, you who said you have, you have witnessed that they gave me $40,000, today is my birthday. And on that altar, may you die with blood in your mouth. I'm serious. If you have not given me $40,000 and you say you have given me $40,000, because this is how when we ask questions, you fail to answer the questions and you rather get some imbeciles to come and say things about people who are mad they are imagine you have viralized the videos and you're sh sharing them nobody has given me forty thousand dollars and if you have given me forty thousand dollars and i've not received it i'm sorry but if you have not given me forty thousand dollars and you people are scheming against it and instead of answering the questions that i'm asking immigration service board that i'm saying let the retirees go that i'm asking the government and you think that you will do that may you die with blood in your mouth you choke on your own blood and die i'm serious the people the two people who recorded that audio and have decided to make it viral and say old man i don't know any old man but if you say I've collected 40,000, I dare you, and I say that you would die with blood in your mouth. I don't, I hate lies. I'm frontal, I'm straight. I hate lies. Today's my birthday. I say, on this altar of my birthday, if I have not taken 40,000, may you die with blood in your mouth. The two people who were recording that video. Danny played a song for me, my birthday song.
birthday song. I'm submitting everything to God. And God, the ultimate judge, will deal with them. I say, let the retirees go and let the young grow. That's all I've said. If you are a retiree this morning, you are 65, 64, 63, 62, 61, 78, whatever it is, you are taking your bath to go and block a young person from working. God has seen you. My bite is that let the retirees go. And since I started, I've seen so many of them honorably pulling out. We respect you for that. Those who are staying on, I say, I wanted to measure your names today and put out the pictures. But I'm hastening slowly because yesterday one of my priests called me and said, More Trish, I'm giving you small allowance. Because I have your letters that are giving you contract extensions. Some of you have even done more than the constitutionally allowed five years and you are still staying on. What kind of evil spirit is that? Your children and grandchildren can't find work to do. You have served your nation for 30 years and more and you are still staying on. Danny, show me the result of... I, I, I sent you a, a, a picture. The young people cannot find jobs today. Yesterday I went to the National Theatre. Latif Abubakar, thank you very much. He celebrated me. At this play. The young girls are now doing what they call hookup. And you're wondering why HIV is up. They are doing hookup. You don't, you don't know what hookup is. They are doing hookup. They are selling themselves chips to men to sleep with them. Hookup. Playing, playing their life prostitution. That's what they are doing. Hookup. They are putting a price tag to it. I'll show you very, very soon. And you'll be disappointed. Small, 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 small girls. They're doing hookup. If you have a daughter, and sometimes she's in the university, you don't know. They are doing hookup. They are hooking themselves up. Hookup, 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 hookup. There's no job for the young people to do. This is it. Their name is there. I know their name. It says Ohima. Uh, well, oh, sorry, I said Ohima. Hookup service. Full night, 170 Ghana with BJ, not broadcast journalism. Half night, 100 Ghana with BJ. Short time, 80 Ghana. Sex video call, 60 Ghana per hour. 30 Ghana per 30 minutes. Account number. That's the number. Hookup. This is a young lady. Who, well, take take note. As it take note, half payment for booking fee for client to sign on, uh, purchase a medication and for transport. What medication? I got to post it now. Hook up. So I say, let the retirees go, and let the young grow. I have no business and prob problem if the retirees are now what do you call it? Board chairman or they are consultants from afar. When the retirees start fighting with young people over jobs, people who have lived longer than Ghana, they are almost close to 100, and they are fighting with young people over the same jobs that young people cannot find, it's a problem. Hookup. That's what the girls are doing now. Hookup. They are selling hookup. They don't know who it is. They don't know where they come from. They are just sleeping with anybody and anything who can afford. So if you have 170 Ghana, you can sleep with her the whole night. That's the problem. If you have 170 Ghana, it's the whole night. If you have 100 Ghana, some part of the night, this is what we have become. The AIDS Commission is screaming, hey, HIV is going high. This is the problem. This is where it comes from. This is where it comes from. They can't find you. You think that if they had a biscuit factory working somewhere like I did many, many years ago at a secondary school, I worked at Gabico Biscuit Factory, you would have people like this roaming the streets. You think you had factories going up and government has stuck to it. One district, one factory, one village, one down. So-called slogans. We would not have had situations like this. One district, one factory. Where are the factories? They say, we have done this. And you go and pick somebody's factory. You do paint. You know talk. The young people cannot find jobs to do. And instead of that, you are giving old people jobs to do. 
people who have finished their on their pension, then you give them contract extension, retention. What is that? What is that? I'm, and I'm so livid because every now and then you get people who walk up to you and ask you those questions. And people ask you for money. It's sad. Young people. I have mates who, the last time somebody told me, one of my producers at 3FM told me that one of my mates who I did an Emmy with that GIJ, Kate walked up to him and said he was working in a fitting shop as an apprentice. He's just looking for an internship space, an MA graduate. That's the situation. People have completed their school. They have done national service. They have done their licensure. Da, 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 da. They are not getting. Then you go and pick retirees and you give them contract extension. Mini bar one now. A brigade of old people. I'm not anti age I say if they are board chairman or if they are consultants from afar, I don't have a problem. Where they have choked the top and they are not allowing young people to enter and they are blocking the chances of young people is an evil spirit. We need to fire them. We need to fire them because you, when you were 28, you were 32, you were 31, you were 27, you were 25, you had a job. You have stayed on that job. Somebody has stayed on the job since 1982. He's still staying on the job. What is wrong with us? 1982, 1987, 1985, you still want to stay on. What kind of evil spirit is that? What has possessed you? That you see your children, and then when you go to church, they call you big man, big man, big man, big man. You are not even ashamed of yourself, big woman. You are, you are not ashamed of yourself. I need you to renew your mind. Reset it. Factory settings. Restore factory settings today. The young people can't find jobs. You are part of the NAPCO people, their problem. You are part of it. You are part of youth in a forest. You are part of it. And you see, the young people join those schemes because they can't find the regular jobs. If we had 6,000 or 5,000 or 10,000 of you, all old people leave those places. We'll have 10,000 freshmen enter the jobs. Whether it's immigration, whether it's fire service, whether it's police, whether it's army, whether it's nursing, whether it's medicine, they will enter. Teaching, they will enter. But you are there. Why you are champion? I tell you, you, you can't go. They say meeting, you can't go. You are tired. Your legs, your limbs are, are weak and feeble. But you still will stay there. And you watch your children. They come and go. They drop application. You put it and put it in the bin. God is watching you. When I'm you, I said this morning, if you have any conscience, after serving your nation for all that while, if you have any conscience on this, my birthday, you will honorably leave. I said, let the retirees go. You yourself will go. And I will stay on this one until all of you have gone. I said, today I wasn't going to put anybody's picture or uh, 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 letter out. In the past two weeks, I've done it. Tomorrow, I will resume. Fresh. I will put all of you. All those who got contract extension for President Lakufuadu. Some of you who lobby and take your chiefs there to go and beg. I will put all your names there. I will mention you. Those of you who are in the private sector who are also blocking children, I will mention you. I will, I will mention you. Because the young people of this country must be able to survive, must be able to fend for themselves, must be able to take care of their inheritance. And I say, in wrapping up, if somebody says they are giving me $40,000, I sign them to God. $40,000, I give you to God. What I said in the beginning, they say I should not say it again. But what I said in the beginning is that if I collected 40,000, if I cross the road, may I die? If you say I've collected and I've all collected, may you die with blood in your mouth. Good morning. So, sorry for the interruption. But due to the acidic content of the atmospheric weather condition in the economy, I have decided wa wo be suma me bia metal afi munti en kabo edi tui na mun sha nso for wache metal one gana city for jollof rice one city 20 pesos for gobe 80 pesos for ke kenke tamai any other kawo one city 50 pesos you know what just give me water for sachet water 30 pesos for bottle water 50 pesos Mokasa me vuda phone cash. Mam de free. Mfamu free. 
metal. Transfer charges and three Da. Switch to Vodafone Cash today and enjoy zero charges whenever you send money to all networks. Yes, sending money is free on Vodafone Cash. Only E-Levy applies. Dial star 110 hash to send money today. Vodafone. From the office to the streets, we all want to go home to a comfortable bed that allows us to relax and rejuvenate for the next day. But choosing the right mattress can be confusing and it's critical for your health and well-being. Most people think that the harder the mattress is, the better. But this is actually not true. A mattress can affect your health in so many ways. If it is too soft, you will sink and your spine will be misaligned. If the mattress is too hard, you will suffer on pressure points, such as your shoulders and your hips. So when selecting a mattress, it's important to choose one that is comfortable and provides proper support. Other factors to consider are whether you sleep on your back, side or face down on your stomach. You will spend one third of your life in bed, so don't compromise when buying a mattress. Let us guide you to select the mattress that best suits you. Don't opt for bad quality, simply because it seems cheaper, or else you did do yourself. Latex Phone, your partner for life. I love coming to school because my school is beautiful. I have lots of friends and learning is so easy. Welcome to North Hills International School. Here we admit students from preschool up to junior high school. We have ultra modern classrooms, an up to date library, a beautiful computer room, a well equipped science lab, excellence in extracurricular activities such as basketball table tennis, football, a swimming pool each for preschool, basic school and junior high school. We teach ballet dancing, cadets and taekwondo. We have professional teachers who are all degree holders. We offer GES and British curricula. We have surround cameras so when your ward comes to school, he or she is protected. Air conditioned buses transport students from home to school and vice versa. We train students to become responsible and ethical citizens of the world. I recommend North Hills International School for your ward. We'll be expecting you. North Hills International School. Gino Magic Pepper. Gino Magic Pepper and Onion. A delicious tomato mix with tomato, pepper, and onion. No grinding, no blending. Ya yenina da da da. So pa median in Come on, Gino, do your magic. Papa, no kunu abefi. Dentistry magic. And your daddy trying to kiss cake. Gino magic pepper and onion. Gino magic pepper and onion. The magic that brings them home. This advert is FDA approved. It's about to get more sporty. With a touch of super entertainment with your favorite stars. Sometimes we play that bit and get a chance to play the football. Who should I take? Funny Cruz? Cruz? Oh, why, why? While keeping you up to date with every trending issue in your world of sports on Wama Plus. But in comes Thomas Kukul and everything changes. And when he said, 